Have you ever wanted to make something just from you? Or add a little extra touch to something? But you don't really draw or paint all that well? Or write very pretty to do it freehand? What if there's a really cool font you'd like to use, but don't know how to get it from your computer onto your project? Well, can you trace a line? Can you color a picture? If yes, then this video is for you. I'm sure most of you know stencils are an easy way to get the lines you need onto your project to color or paint. But what if you want something that isn't a pre-made stencil? Or it's not the right size for your project? That's where carbon paper comes in, also known as graphite paper. Carbon paper does keep a ghost image of whatever is transferred, but you can use it multiple times before losing too much quality. This paper is very hard to find in physical stores. You might find small squares of it in your local craft store. If you want a larger piece, you'll need to go online to buy it. Here's some projects that I've made through the years. I trace these angels from a coloring book. I use gel pens to color them in. Aren't they sweet? I painted the lid on this box to make it a recipe box. I took brown paper bags from the grocery store and colored with gel pens and then wrapped Christmas gifts with it. This is a good craft idea for people of all ages and multiple media types can be used. Here's some wall mural projects that took a lot of time and patience. I hope this gives you some ideas for your next project.